Oh, ooh, ooh. Okay, if I would have ollied just a couple more times, I would have had the speed I needed to get that. Wow. All right, so let's try out Skate 1 on the Xbox Series X. Now, I'm not expecting a big difference in loading times. There wasn't really one for Skate 3, so I think it's just Xbox 360 games really don't see improved loading times when it comes to the Xbox Series X. I don't know why that is, but that could be the case. Let's go ahead and pick my character. Uh, I have no idea where to start. Let's start at the community center, the place where it all starts. And we're just going to check out the loading time real quick. Like I said, it doesn't, it, it seems, it seems like normal, I guess. I don't know. That seemed pretty quick, but uh, who knows? And right off the bat, it looks really smooth. The frame rate looks really smooth. Like I'm very impressed with the frame rate so far but the frame rate is also really good on the xbox one and the xbox one x and i think this looks about the same as the xbox one x uh they didn't get the 4k treatment for skate one it might look a little better than the xbox one x but i'm not really seeing a difference but who knows there might it might be a little bit more crisp but I think the game is just running at maybe 1080p and then is being upscaled to 4K by the Xbox. So yeah, not really much difference. I, I don't I don't believe. I think where you're gonna see the most difference is if you try out the auto HDR feature and it'll give Skate 1 HDR. I don't believe you can do that on the Xbox One X. And unfortunately, I really don't have a reliable way to show you what HDR will look like because just the way everything gets recorded you're really gonna have to test out HDR for your own on your own TV and that's the best way you're going to be able to experience not through my YouTube videos <laughs> all right let's just play around maybe I'll try to do some challenges I'm I'm going to try to treat this like a normal skate one video just on the Xbox Series X so there is a gap right here that I like to do it's not very big or anything but it's a little difficult just because of you magnetically grind that ledge right there and you have to avoid it makes it a little bit more difficult but uh maybe if we could just ride off <sighs> seriously <laughs> let's try to do a nolly hard flip late back 180 or a ghetto bird if you will Ooh. okay <laughs> i'm gonna get that i don't even care okay that was sketchy but i'm gonna take it All right, let's move from the suburbs. Let's go somewhere else. I want to see what every place looks like. Let's go to Old Town. And honestly, I am really impressed with Skate One's frame rate. It looks really, really smooth. So I think there's a spot down here. Yeah, it's it's right here. And it was requested by Young Stony 420, I believe. He uh, he posted a video clearing this double set right here, and he wants me to do it. So I'm going to show you guys his video, and then we're going to try it out. So all I should have to do is just bomb this hill and clear the stair set, right? Is that all I got to do? Come on. Do I have enough speed? Oh, <laughs> first try, but not, not really the best. Really sketchy. I want to try something else. So I'm thinking a uh, fakey big spin. Hopefully it lets me do it right here. Oh, wow. That's that is going to be difficult <laughs> okay so i think a good plan would be to just go into fakie at the beginning and then ride it out like that it seems easier that way instead of like trying to pop up on the sidewalk and go into fakie just seems a lot easier this way so i'm hoping this will work wow yeah it's going to work now i just gotta roll away okay Okay, that was a sketchy landing, but I was able to roll away nicely. I think it looked nice. Now, I think Young Stoney had another challenge as well, and that will give us a chance to go to a different part of the map. And I believe it's close to the library. It's right here and down. Okay, yeah, it's right there. So let's head towards the library and try to do his challenge.
And I think that is going to be fun. I don't think I've ever cleared that before. I've always wanted to, but I don't think I ever have. So this is going to be a fun challenge. Now, I have an idea. Let's go down the middle of the library because I know there's some uh, there's some ramps and stuff right here in the middle. So, yeah, there we go. <laughs> so I'm thinking we can just like pop off these ramps right here like that and then pop into this one. Oh, oh and then the next one. Uh, it didn't work out that last one, but maybe we have enough speed to clear this. Let's try to tray flip it first. Wow. I didn't make it all the way. That's actually surprising. <laughs> didn't make it all the way to the bottom. Let's try. Let's try this a couple more times, and then I have another idea. Got that one. Got that one. And yeah, it's really hard to get into that second little ramp right there. I just don't think that it's going to work out this way. Nope. Let's move on to this over here. All right. So let's try to use these ramps on the side instead. It's a little bit longer run up, but I think we can get more speed this way. And let's just, I don't know, do a trick right here. Try to maintain our speed. Okay. We can go down right here. Is there anything else? Oh yeah. Right here too. This is going to be enough. I feel like, yeah, that's going to be enough. Let's get a, just a tray flip down. Yes, got the tray flip. <laughs> I think that came out really nice. So while I was playing on this, I did notice a thing over here that I like to do. I like to do it on skate two. I don't know if I've done it on skate one, but uh, yeah, I'm going to try to clear. Oh, I don't think that's going to work. I'm going to try to clear over to that last platform, then maybe do a nose manual across it. Wow. I don't think it's going to work here. I might have to do like a melon or something just to get that extra height like that. Oh, okay. We can make it work. <laughs> maybe. Ah, uh, sick. I like that. Okay, let's move on to our last challenge. And it's right here at the art gallery. Nice. The train station is right there. Okay, what I want to do at the art gallery is clear this five set. I think there's, yeah, five stair sets here. I want to clear from the top. All the way to the bottom in one go. I think I did this on skate three, but I don't believe I've ever done it on skate one. So let's go ahead and try to find a way to get speed. I think we're just going to go to the very top of the hill. I really don't want to mess around with this challenge. I just want to go to the very top, try to get my speed and see what goes from there. And here we are. I've made it all the way to the top. There's no more hills around. All we can do now is just go down. <laughs> now I'm going to try to. I'm going to try to do this the best I can. I'm going to have to do these ollies over and over again just to gain my speed. I'm just showing you guys exactly how I'm doing it. And like I said, I really don't want to mess around with this challenge just because the run up is just so long and you need so much speed for this. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just going to try to show you the whole thing. Maybe some of you will want to do this at home as well. So just follow the way I'm going and hopefully you'll be able to get this. I know I'm going to have some troubles with this. I don't expect this to like <laughs> happen first try, but who knows? I might get lucky right here. I seriously. Oh, wow. I messed up. Okay. Let's go through here and then you're going to have to pop in here. Wow. Oh, oh, almost got lucky. <laughs> Maybe if I would have popped a lot better and uh, I don't know <laughs> if I would have done a couple things different, I think I would have got that. Now, I think the toughest part about this challenge is going to be right there at the beginning of the stair set. I feel like that's going to be the toughest part. Just because you have so much speed coming into this and you have this little bit of room that you can maneuver right here. Now the speed wobbles are really crazy right here. I don't <laughs> I don't like the speed wobbles. Oh, I should have been ollieing some more right here. That sucks. Ollie down into this. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, if I would have ollied just a couple more times, I would have had the speed I needed to get that. Wow. Oh, and one more thing. 
I'm going to try to use the double grab glitch to land this because I feel like the impact might be too much. Like if I try to land it without the glitch and <laughs> I would hate to find out that, you know, I finally get it and I'm not able to land it just cause the impact is too much. So I'm just going to start off with the double grab glitch from the get go. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> I landed into a grind. Why? Why did I do that? I want to land not in a grind. I just want to land straight out. Why? Why do this to me, game? I totally cleared that, though. You guys could see that. Ah, uh, here it is. Here it is. Ah! Uh. <laughs> if I could just roll away a little bit longer, man. I, I made it. I made it. All right. All right. Yes. Yes, I got it. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> you know what? I think that's going to be it for this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, make sure to hit that like button. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit that bell so you actually get notified when I upload. Let me know what you think about this video in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.